I'm Ms. Artastic again. This video art tutorial for day 23 of the June Drawing Bonanza. We are going to be drawing a pineapple to draw something to draw with and something to draw on, and let's make some pineapple art. If you're just joining me and you're like, what do you mean day 23, Mr. Tastic? Well, it is day 23 of the June Drawing Bonanza where every single day I am posting a YouTube video drawing tutorial to help you take your art skills from here, make them super mad, crazy awesome by bringing them up, by coming on and joining me every day to draw with me. So we're doing 30 days of drawing. Today is day 23 and today we are drawing a pineapple. We are gonna be starting our pineapple the curved line somewhere in the middle of our page. Next we're gonna add just a couple zigzags in and then we're gonna go down two more curves. Next we're gonna zigzag in again and then guess what? One more curve down guys. Here we go. Check that out. A little zigzag. We've got a little cute little fluffy but sort of not fluffy because they're kind of prickly pineapple body. Yeah. All right, we are going to add two ovals on the bottom because of course this pineapple has feet because otherwise it'd be boring if it didn't have feet. All right, connect the bottom with some curving lines just like that. Oh yeah, so cool. Okay, and let's do a pineapple face. For the face, we're gonna do one, two curved lines, one on either side. And then you can go ahead and thicken it up. We're gonna do a slanty mouth. And then you can so you draw a diagonal line and then we're gonna connect it with a U shape. We'll draw a letter M on the inside, and then you can color in the dark of the mouth, leaving just the tongue, which is that letter M, nice and white. Now I like to get expressive, so I'm gonna add some curving lines around the mouth, and you can also add them around the eyes for some expressive features. If you want, you can add, add them around the legs and body. Just gives a little bit of texture and stuff to it. So cute. If you want to give your pineapple some cheeks and you have some room, you can put a couple little ovals beneath the eyes. And then you're ready for some foliage. Draw a nice big leaf shape up the center on the top. And then we're gonna do one, two curving lines on either side of that leaf shape. Bring it back and connect. Now you got a pineapple top just like that. So easy. Once you know, you know, right? You'll never forget. Okay, add a line up the middle for some added detail. It also gives you the opportunity to do two different values. Like I can do two different types of greens, so I can do a yellow green and a green, whatever you want. A dark green and a light green. All right, and once you're done, you are ready to color. So you can go ahead and grab your favorite pineapple colors, whatever they might be. It's really up to you. I'm gonna do my, my, uh, dual chrome greens here in my foliage. Now I add some variety. Yeah, variety. And you can go ahead and pick whatever colors make you happy and you can go ahead and color in your lovely pineapple using your favorite colors and also your choice art medium.
And once you're done coloring in your lovely pineapple, your awesome pineapple design is done. Well, that's it for this episode. Please make sure that you subscribe to the channel, Ms. Artastic. And if you create anything and share it online on social media, please, please, I would love to see it. So tag me at Ms. Artastic and I will check it out or join the community and conversation and use the hashtag, hashtag Ms. Artastic. And I will check it out that way as well. And you can see what other people are creating who create with Ms. Artastic. YouTube videos. Well, that's it for this episode and I will see you in the next.